In this video, we will be demonstrating how to calibrate a height master uh, at eight inches. Uh, to do this, we will be using this eight inch gauge block and a surface plate, um, as well as this uh, inductive probe test indicator uh, mounted to a height stand. This isn't relevant to it, but it's useful to hold the test, in test indicator. Um, I've already cleaned the surfaces, but you want to make sure the surface of the surface plate, the height master, as well as this gauge block are uh, clean. I'm going to position it next to the 8 inch setting on the height gauge. We'll zoom in. And we'll just position them next to each other. Next, we will set this test indicator on our gauge block. So this is now measuring eight inches. So we've set it, it's pretty good, pretty consistent. And we're gonna move over. Here's the reading for the height master at eight inches. I'll go back one more time. Repeat it on the gauge block, the eight inch gauge block. Go back over, we get about 65, 70, 70 millionths. Uh, so this is low from the eight inches by about 65 millionths. And also there is a, uh, heat plays a major factor in such long lengths as this. So uh, with uh, measurements this tall and this accurate, I'd let it sit for many minutes, if not an hour for each measurement, just to really let it temperature soak, make sure these, uh, I did not add any heat uh, during the handling or touching of these uh, metal uh, gauges. So one other thing to keep in mind, you can check also the depth and the height and the parallel and flatness of this surface just by running the test indicator over it. And there's the reading.